Hi, Cancer. How are you doing? Um, today is February 15th, 2017. What I will be doing for you today are Secrets of the Unk readings. Okay. Um, Secrets of the Unk has to deal with your past six months to a year ago. Okay. Six months to a year. Um, what you learned from your past. Okay. Um, how your past is affecting your present. Your near future from today onward. And the underlining message for the entire reading. Okay? Okay, Cancer. Um, in your past, six months to a year ago, you have the Eight of Cups. Alright? Uh, the Eight of Cups has to deal with a situation um, that wasn't good for you. Okay? Um, that wasn't good. Um, I'm feeling that some of you found out that someone was pregnant and it kind of caused you to worry even more about that person. Maybe they had a child already um, and they had another one and you're really worried about their health because maybe this person still has habits that they haven't broken yet and you're worried about the uh, well-being of the children. Okay, this could be your grandchildren. This could be the well-being of your own children. Okay? What you learned from your past, you have the Queen of Pentacles. Um, I'm feeling that you had to save money. Um, you had to come into yourself and really uh, dig deep and s save a lot of money. Possibly um, for um, uh, a child. Okay, you had to save money for a child, um, um, and I'm also feeling possibly grandchildren. Okay, you had to save, but for some reason, um, you were very worried about where your finances were going to come from. Okay, in your um, present, okay, what's affecting how your past is affecting your present situation? All right, you have, you have the page of Pentacles. You're coming up with new ideas, all right? Um, coming up with new ideas. The pages are always fresh, young energy. You could be dealing with a younger Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. This could be a child of yours, okay? Um, definitely a child, uh, someone younger than you. And you, you need... I feel like you want to try to find or figure out a way to help them get money. Maybe they're having difficulty at, uh, in their work. They're, they're probably having difficulty finding a job um, to keep them stable. Um, so you're needing to really uh, delve deep and look for a way to find um, a way to help them on a financial front. Okay. In your near future from today onward, you have the higher font. The Hierophant is the sign of Taurus, or it is also um, being a teacher. Um, from financial, uh, what do you call that? Financial counseling. Um, you're helping. Uh, a, you're kind of being stepping in and being like a teacher to someone. Uh, financially, you're kind of showing them how you're showing them how to save their money. Maybe they maybe you feel like they waste their money. All right. Um, so you're trying to find, figure out a way to get them to learn to be more independent. Okay. You want them to venture off on their own. Okay. Your underlying message. You have the Knight of Wands. The Knight of Wands. Um, knights are always uh, fire signs. Okay. A young adult. The knights are young adult fire signs, but they don't necessarily have to be. Just someone coming in. Um, and helping you financially. Alright. I'm hearing casino. Alright. I'm feeling like someone is probably opening up a casino. Or someone won a lot of money. By playing at a casino. And they're sharing the funds. These are like three people. Sharing the funds that someone else got off of. of this is a financial windfall. That's being shared between three different people. A child, a mother, and a father, or a male figure, okay? 
Um, I'm also feeling uh, this this could be you showing up here as a Queen of Pentacles, but these are Earth signs. But this could be showing up as um, you know somebody that is willing to help this person. Okay, it could be your child willing to help them financially. It could be you or somebody else willing to help them. And I'm also feeling car. You could be buying this person a car because they have children. And you want it to be easier for them to get around. They just have to get their license. Um, they have to get their permit first before they can uh, drive. And you're needing to possibly be around them while they're driving. You don't want anything. Um, you know, you want to... I know that people who are new, it can make you a little uncomfortable, okay? People who are new to learning how to drive, you want to be around them, all right? Because you don't want them to uh, accidentally turn down the wrong street or something. So you're um, being around them and helping them learn how to drive or you're an onlooker. You're looking at uh, observing someone else learning how to drive, all right? Or even have drive in their life. You want them to pick up. You want them to come out of um, mental anxiety about um, their situation. Um, there. Do you want them to come out of that? Okay. Um. Your near future. Okay. The hierophant. You're taking class. Some of you are taking classes. I'm hearing. Um. You're going back to school. Okay, you're taking classes. I'm hearing um, some of you are even doing GD. All right. Um, GD classes. Um, grad school. Some of you are in grad school and it's tough. Okay. It's tough, but you have someone here who's willing to help you study. Okay. Someone's helping you study and get your papers uh, completed. And I'm also hearing cheating. So I hope you're not cheating on a test. <laughs> um, but they're helping you, okay? Um, I'm hearing straight A's. So, uh, hopefully, this could be a child that you have in school that is getting straight A's, okay? And you're very happy about them. Because you're so happy, you're um, giving them an allowance or you're giving them uh, money or some type, some type of reward for doing well in school. Okay, sounds good. Um, okay, your situation. Um, your six months, your six months to a year. Um, Eight of Cups. Um, some of you had a problem with drinking, possibly um, also smoking. I'm feeling, and you had someone had to come in and get you out of that. Okay, you had to stop. It was time to. All right, it was kind of affecting your work it was affecting your work environment or you know someone that was smoking too much and it affected their work could be a capricorn towards virgo and they had to leave their job because they were smoking okay and you miss this person a lot all right you miss them okay you miss them and you don't understand um you, you're trying to make out why try to figure out why they left you know why they left, but you feel you also feel kind of responsible for why they left. All right, you kind of you told you told something that you kept. Okay, something that you kept to yourself. You ended up telling other people about it. Okay. Um. In with your present situation, um, back to that person, you're thinking about them. You're thinking about this Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. You're thinking about their well-being. I'm getting that uh, some somebody moved away, okay? Um, someone moved away very far. Uh, they could have went to another country. Um, they could, you know, a Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo that is married. Um, they're going to visit their spouse. In the Dominican Republic, you know, um, they're going to visit this person that they haven't seen in a, in a while. And you know, and you're finding out that they move for financial purposes. Maybe they found work in another country, in another state. Um, it was difficult for them here um, where, they, where they lived. So you found 
they you're finding out that they found another way to um uh make money and support themselves and i also feel with this that they're finding out that they're pregnant as well um they're, they're finding out that they're pregnant and um needing to move quickly all right they're pregnant and they're in the delivery is pretty fast pace okay um hearing a c-section they're getting a c-section done okay um but all is well um i don't hear anything negative about that um twins possibly a boy and a girl okay um okay I'm also interesting, very interesting. I don't know if someone is knows who Angel Silva is, but I'm getting that as well. Angel Silva, okay. Um, finding out something about Angel Silva. I don't know if you guys know who Angel Silva is. All right. I'm also hearing that song by Dwelle. I don't know if you know who Dwelle is, the singer. Um, I'm cheating on my girl, girl, that song. Um, I hope that no one is, uh, I don't know if you're finding out that you've um, been cheated on, okay, or you're finding out someone cheated uh, with someone else. You're finding out about a cheating situation. Could be cheating um, out on a deal, cheating out in a relationship. Um, they're lying about their expertise okay but uh you've found a way you you're talking about it to other people you're finding out that someone is lying about who they are and you're you f you feel like this person is lying about who they are but they're not they're really not they are who they say they are but you don't believe it okay um, with your Queen of Pentacles here, um, you're tired of waiting. I'm feeling like some of you are tired of waiting on a Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Okay, you're tired of waiting on this person. Um, they're taking a long time to... I don't know. They're, I'm getting get dressed, okay? Maybe they're, maybe they're getting married. Someone, a woman, female is getting married around you. Um, but they're taking a long time to get dressed and I'm hearing concert hall so maybe they're taking long to get ready to go to a concert okay um, I'm also hearing someone is going on a date so there's a uh, dating going on proposals um, your night of your night of ones here someone is trashing a party to reveal some kind of truth okay someone's coming in and crashing a party to reveal something that uh is not true it is it's messing up your situation almost okay it's like you have something good going for yourself and then someone comes in and starts spewing out angry words to you all right accusing you of lying of cheating etc okay all right then um cancer thank you for joining me today this is a snippet i'm trying not to do the video super long i could go on forever with these messages but um i hope that you enjoyed that if you liked it please contact me via um instant message on facebook don't forget to like share like share and comment um if you liked if you enjoyed it okay thank you cancer for joining me and have a good day